restarted negotiations between sag Dare and the alliance of motion picture and television producers that could mean an end to the actor's strike have raised hopes for this year's American film market, which runs October-November 31st. Five in Santa Monica. What everyone is hoping for is, in the words of one leading indie producer, that we can all get back to business. Even without a new sag FTRA deal, there is a healthy batch of new titles on offer, a mix of international features and U.S. indie films that have secured interim agreements from the union to begin production. In the last few days, we've seen a waterfall of lineups, says Nadia Zayonchkovska, CCO of newly founded Ukraine distributor Greenlight Films which will be making its market debut at this year's AFM. Lots of theatrical films, lots either in post or in pre-production, ready to shoot in the first quarter of 2024. It's looking very positive. FI features from Brad Anderson and Alex Garland, dramas with Olivia Coleman, Dev Patel, Halle Berry and Gina Davis, and plenty of movies with those tried and true AFM staples Sharks, Demons, and Zombies. Here is a closer look Beast of War, Director Kia Roach Turner, Was World War II with Sharks, Cornerstone's latest from the director of the Wormwood franchise of cult Aussie zombie actioners. Promises a most AFM friendly mashup of period war thriller with survivalist horror in a story of a band of soldiers stranded in the open ocean facing assault from above and attacks from a great white below. Director Alex Garland. Stars Kirsten Dunst, Wagner Mora, Stephen Henderson, Kelly Spaney. Was the new sci fi action film from ex machina director Garland is certain to trigger bidding from global buyers. The almost too topical plot line is set in a near future United States on the brink of collapse with embedded journalists racing to tell the biggest story of their lives the end of America as we know it. Sales A24. Conception. Director Camille Griffin. Star Kira Knightley. Was Oscar nominee Kira Knightley reteams with her Silent Night director Griffin on this Black Mirror esque dystopian thriller, set in a future Britain where the government has taken control over parenting? Knightley plays a loyal civil servant accustomed to upholding the system, who becomes a victim of it when events endanger her own parental status. Sales Fortitude, CAA, Range Media Partners. Cowgirl's Last Ride. Director Lena Yadov. Stars Gina Davis, Scoot McNary, Julia Sweeney, Jill Scott. Was Thelma and Louise star Davis hits the road for one last adventure in this Golden Agers comedy. Playing an unorthodox retired Texas cowgirl who escapes her Dallas nursing home and heads cross-country to her old homestead in East Texas in an effort to stop her son Randall, McNary, from selling the family home. All actors were attached before the SAG strike and shooting is planned for the first half of 2024. Sales Hanway Films Greedy People Director Potsy Ponsaroli Stars Lily James, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, Himesh Patel, Tim Blake Nelson, Yuzo Aduba, Jim Gaffigan. Was Waking Ned Devine meets a simple plan in this darkly comic thriller about a group of eccentric residents of a small, picturesque island town who find a murdered man with a million dollars and make all the wrong choices. Sales Mr. Smith Entertainment, Ver Ventures High in the Clouds. Director Toby Jenkel. Star Paul McCartney. This family-friendly 3D animation remains one of the few dependable genres on the independent market. In this British effort, from the amazing Maurice director Jenkel, boasts original music from ex-Beatle Paul McCartney, who will compose the soundtrack, as well as produce, the adaptation of his 2005 children's book, co-written by Philip Ardaugh and illustrated by Jeff Dunbar. 
The adventure tale follows a rebellious teenage squirrel who faces off against a dictatorial owl who has banned all music from his town. Highlander. Director Chad Stahelski. Stars Henry Cavill. Was it Highlander? Lionsgate's hotly anticipated reboot of the 1980s Swords and Immortals franchise has been in development for years, but with John Wick Helmer Stahelski and Superman Henry Cavill officially attached, the project will finally go on sale at AFM this year. By far the biggest movie at the 2023 market, the only $100 million plus project out there. This is guaranteed to trigger bidding wars in virtually every territory. Sales Lionsgate. Late Night with the Devil. Directors Cameron Cairns and Colin Cairns. Stars David Dast Malkian. The Suicide Squad and Oppenheimer actor Dast Malkian plays a 1970s Johnny Carson rival whose Halloween Sweeps Week special goes horribly wrong in this found footage period shocker ho which to best screenplay honors at the Sidges Horror Festival this year. For Australian directors Colin and Cameron Cairns.